So, I'm gonna take some of the. Oh. Hey, hey, what's up, good people? This is Shelby. Thank you so much for coming to my channel. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. We are always about to go down here. Uh, and if you are returning, then thank you so much for coming. I hope you bought a friend. You know, there's more the merrier. We got plenty of space up in here. We need as many of your friends as possible. So everybody, as a group, join hands. Let's just join hands and go down to the bottom and hit the like button, hit the subscribe button. Let's have some YouTube unity, you know, and get them numbers up. Um, as you can see, I already have my face done and I have my eyes primed. Um, if you'd like to see the detailed version of my foundation routine, there's a link down below in the description box. I'm gonna hop in with the Too Faced Tutti Fruity collection. Um, I love this palette and this is the Razzle Dazzle Berry palette. I've only used this about once or twice. I love the colors so I'm really excited to go ahead and uh, hop into this and come out with something, well you know, hot fire. Like that's the plan, right? Right. Okay. The first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with this uh, light edit brush from Hourglass and I'm going to take my dark mineralized skin finish and I'm just going to put some powder underneath my eye to that I can then dust away when we're done in case there's any fallout okay just enough all right next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to go in with a blending brush from let's see this is from crown I got this free in a uh that Fab Fit Fun Box, honestly, it wasn't the best set of, you know, stuff, but I felt really good about this brush. So I'm going to keep using it. So I'm going to go into this color right here, which is, ooh, I think it's Pink Suede. I like Pink Suede. So we'll start with that. And then put this high above the crease. And, uh, and then we'll, it'll just be our, our start. So what are some of y'all's favorite things about fall? I think for me in the Bay Area, fall is interesting because we get what is, I think, not politically correctly called an Indian summer. And uh, <laughs> we get like cold and we'll get wind and we'll get rain. Like Even in the early summer months, we'll get it. And then it'll get cold, it'll get warm again, actually. So we'll get a um like a heat wave at the end of September beginning of October and it'll just go for like weeks like I'm surprised that it's not really really hot right now I mean the sun is out and it's really bright but um it's not warm but like normally it wouldn't be surprised to uh to walk outside and just be like sweating that is such a pretty color and I know I'm going a little ham on it but uh that's because it's going to be my foundation color and a lot of it's going to get covered up. So. I'm sorry, I primed my eyes with the LA Girl Concealer in the shade Cool Tan. I'm surprised I haven't run out of that because I use that like all the time. Yeah, I'm going to mix this color from the Too Faced collection and I'm going to mix it with Wanderlust from Karen's collection. Of course, one thing I didn't know was going to happen at this time of year was the number of weddings I have been invited to or informed of at least, let's see, three weddings in the last, oof, that occurred in the last three weeks. So that means the end of September straight through the middle of October has been like wedding season in my circle of friends and family and it has been nuts like the ones I wanted to like I wanted to go to all of them but I just couldn't go like it was like I had a trip planned and I, I usually plan my trips pretty far in advance notice the tan I don't know if you see the tan but I have a tan um but I plan my trips pretty far in advance so if I don't know you getting married not that you should set your wedding amount me let's not let's not say that but if I don't know you're getting married, Shelby might not make it. I'm going to put a little bit more of Wanderlust in here. 
just so I can have a little bit more of a, a, more, a ready purple kind of vibe. Anyway, so I've been looking at weddings and pictures of things, of people's weddings and wedding dresses and bridesmaids and cake I didn't get to eat. And I'm just like, well, I want to go to everything, but that's not realistic. That's not going to happen. So I have to let that go and go back into peach suede and just buff this out. I'm going to bring it actually in closer. And I had it before. And up. So, I'm going to go in with some more LA Girl. And I'm going to cut this crease. And let me go ahead and this color right here which is called bad to the berry I'm gonna start with a flat brush and then I'll probably go in and cover it with my finger after I spray it But it looks black. Okay, new plan. Let's go into the Dose of Colors I Love Sarahi and we'll take this one and see if it looks a little bit better. Ooh, it does. And then I'll go in with my finger. go in with this color by itself I'm going to go in with this lovely color right here the flat brush I actually don't know how fall this is looking, but it's looking pretty. Hmm. And that color is this color right here, which is Buried Treasure. Going back in with pink suede. Okay, so this is um, this is only fall in the sense that it feels like Halloween, but I uh, I kind of legit love this. You've probably never seen this on my channel before because I've never done this before, but um, <laughs> that's legit. Okay, I need a wing. So I'm going to do that and then we'll figure out what we're doing underneath our eyes because I'm tempted to use the glitter but that could go way left real fast. Before I do my liner, I think I'm going to go in with this Marc Jacobs pencil in eggplant and uh, see how I like that. If I can get it to right. See how I like that in my waterline. Hmm. Actually, I might tight line with this. Let me tight line.
time to wing it. Wing it. Wing it. Wing it. Wing it. Wing it. Alright. Let me use some of this. And then I'm going to smudge it with a little smudger brush. And then I'll go in with a little bit, the tiniest bit of black. Just a little. It's so easy to please, guys. Truly. I promise you. It's nuts. Um, let's go. I want to do a big lash. The Batty B. Can you see that? Batty B lashes in Sugar Baby. I love these lashes. I've only worn them once, but they're big, but I felt I couldn't feel them when I had them on, which was awesome. So, that's what we're going to put on. I put the um, glue on them already, so I'm just waiting for them to dry. We'll give that some time. In the meantime, let's go ahead and do this under eye. I'm going to start with Wanderer and then I'll follow it up with the dark purple in the other palette. It's uh, this purple. Lashes are almost dry. Lashes may already be dry. Wow. So let's go in with uh, let's go in with the same brush now that the lashes are on and add some of the this color which is oh shoot i forgot my color again razzle it's gonna follow up that little bit of color with some pink suede to mute it out a little bit and now I'm going to spray my face and then I'm going to break the cardinal rule. I'm going to do a bold lip and a bold eye. It's going to be a lot. I hope you're ready. But after I bronze the, per the perimeter of my face, though, I feel like I'm a little light. No light skin finish and deep dark. It's going to. the face with MAC Mineralized Skin Finish. Actually, no. Just going to spray the face with Morphe Matte Continuous Setting Mist. <clears throat> Do not touch your face. Don't touch it. Even though it's so pretty that you want to. <laughs> All right. Oh, and um, while my face dries, I got a call out. Um, I have on the NARS Assist Palette. This is becoming my go-to. And I believe the two colors that I have on are this one and that one, I think. Uh, which would be Penthouse and Exposed, I think. 
I'm, I could be wrong. Uh, I keep getting that wrong. And I keep also dropping the stupid little plastic things. Anyways. Mm, okay. Lip, 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 lip. The lipstick, I'm going to try, put on the MAC Chunky Velvet Tease Lip Pencil in the color Velveteen. It's a really, really deep uh, red. But first, I'm going to go in with a little bit of a cork to give myself um, some guidelines. For some reason we were not recording we were not recording so you didn't get that but this is what it looks like i'm going to put a little bit more of cork on the outside rim just to make it a little more definite where we're going okay last thing is the bottom lash mascara I know I didn't put any mascara on my upper lash um, why didn't I put it out there because these lashes are huge and there's no way you would be able to see my real ones uh, I'm gonna go in with the Ulta brand limitless lashes I actually do like this fountain mascara the only thing I don't like about it is that it um it makes your lashes a little hard This is our finished look. Uh, I'm really happy with how it turned out. It definitely took a hard left, more towards Halloween, less towards the uh, October fall season. But that's okay, because purple is a fall color, so it's totally fine. Um, I hope that you enjoyed this tutorial. I loved wearing the uh, Baddie B lashes again in Sugar Baby. And um, I really enjoyed playing around with, uh, with mixing. Mm really enjoyed mixing these two palettes together so this was cool uh, and I like the way it came out I haven't worn this lipstick in ages so I love how it looks hmm. I'm also really impressed at least I'm impressed with my eyes uh, I like the way they came out and I will have to experiment more with placing shadow in different places than I'm used to because this is this is intense I need somewhere to go I ain't going nowhere I'm gonna go make lunch that's what I'm going to go do. In the meantime, while I go make lunch, you go down below, hit comment, and subscribe, and also hit like, and just hit, subscribe to my Instagram. It should be right here somewhere. Yeah, right? Yeah, right here somewhere. <laughs> uh, and follow me. Uh, let me know your thoughts. Let me know what you want to see. Let me know if there's anything you want me to try out. Um, and if you just, in general, just like hanging out with me, I am happy to have you. Thank you so much for your time and thank you for watching. Have an awesome day. I'll talk to you soon.